Well, thank you very much for joining me on the red carpet, guys. Can you just very quickly introduce yourself and your film? Yes, uh, my name is Athanasia and we are the Rajas Had Enough and I'm one of the producers. I'm uh, Ekaterina, I'm one of the directors, one of the, a director. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hi, I'm Axel Eva and I'm one of the producers with Athanasia. I'm Margarita and I'm the DP of this film. Amazing, and so which one of you wrote the film? Uh, writer is not here. Oh, not here. Um, but the idea was created by Axel. Amazing, and so what, can you briefly, without any spoilers, just go through what, what the film is about? Uh, yeah, so we wanted to, I pitched something for our student, uh, for our grad film, and we wanted to make a dark comedy about violence against women. Yep. So using the fantasy element, we try to bring a fresh take to the story of violence against women. So we've got Raja, who works at the Afterlife Bureau, who comes down to earth to try and change the fate of women who um, face violence on earth. Amazing. And so what inspired, was there an, an event that inspired this or a particular story that you read or saw? Uh, I think it's just we um, experienced walking home a lot uh, as women and wanting to create something that was slightly more positive and right. uh, put that in a film. Mm. Um, I'm sure Katia can also tell you yeah. about that. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, there wasn't like one specific source for the story. Right. It was more about just the general feeling of walking home alone, walking home at night and experiencing some fears, but also it's like, we didn't want to make the film very dark and depressing and just, right. as Axel said, to bring a fresh take to it. So what sort of is the main takeaway for people watching the film? What do you want people to get out of it? Um, I guess we wanted, when we, we don't have a lot of control over it in our real lives, but when watching the film, wanted, what we wanted was to have that little bit of feeling of empowerment, which yeah. is why we bring in that fantastical element and Raja, because she's someone who can make a change, whereas in real life we don't. So I think that's kind of the element that we wanted to bring to it and just raise awareness as well in a little bit of a new way yeah. um, to the topic. And, yeah. yeah, it's like maybe the ending is like a bittersweet mm -hmm. because uh, it encompasses both things that Axel has said. So that's yes, but also, oh my God, there's so, in so many countries, so many women face this daily, mm -hmm. hourly, right this second, so. Yeah, yeah. it's a very, uh, very important topic. And, and finally, how do you feel being here at the Manchester Film Festival to screen your film today? I'm very excited, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Super excited. It's always exciting to see the film on the big screen, so yeah. Yes. Have you seen it on the big screen before? Yes. Yeah. 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 We've been to a couple of other festivals as well, but I think this is our biggest one yet. Yeah. Ah, and nice. we've seen some of the lovely shorts that have been here in the previous days, so yeah. it's really great to be one of them. Yes, um, it's amazing. so nice and we're humbled. Thank you. Amazing. Well, I can't wait to see the film. Best of luck yes. with the screening, guys. Thank you. Thank no you. No worries. Thank you.